What up gamers, friends here, here, and welcome back to Zenless Zone Zero. So yeah guys, let's continue on over here and do the commissions uh, with Belle and discuss it with her. But yeah, I've also um, increased the, the volume by like 5%. Hopefully that's better. I found like like the the, the voices were kind of low um, in general, so I increased it just like, you know, 5%, like I said. Hopefully it's better. I'll keep experimenting with it until I'm satisfied with like the sound levels but I think in combat it might be a bit loud though I don't know we'll see we'll see like you know cutscene wise it's low but then combat it can get pretty loud all right let's go talk to Bell here I mean yeah it was nothing but cutscenes in the previous video so <laughs> maybe it's fine um uh, you already met with General Chop and Susie to sort out the commission. That was fast wise. As proxies, we can move around in the hollow freely. That's something most people can't boast of being able to do. But still, we need agents with combat experience, like the cunning hares to handle ethereals and other dangers. As usual, you should get in touch with trusted agents to accompany you. Hey, signal search has been unlocked. Is that the... Like, she was talking about other agents. Is this the... The poles? The gacha? Oh, I think this is it. I see the rainbow TV. That's what the primo gems were for me. Like, that I saw in this game. Um, you can quickly obtain agents or W engines via signal searches. Oh, okay. So, W engines are, like, the weapons in this game? Or, like, the light cones or whatever? Uh, the stable channel has special events for new citizens. Oh yeah, I just saw the highlight thing. So limit 5, 20% off for 10 searches 5 times. Limits 1, S rank signal guaranteed in 50 searches. A rank or higher signal guaranteed in 10 searches. S rank signal guaranteed in 90 searches. So I'm guessing that's their pity system. But yeah, this time they, they see it like right away. <laughs> Uh, let's take a look at other events. Selectable agents. Oh, we can choose? This is a selector? Oh. Oh, but I don't see the one that I wanted though. After a number, a certain number of signal searches, you can select an agent to obtain. Oh, we can even do demos too. Okay, that's good. Because I, I don't know much about these characters. Like, yeah, I've seen these guys. They look really cool. Oh, wait. Is it? I mean, the one I have right now, like that free person that I got. I think she's also in the same faction with this guy, the Victoria Housekeeping Company. I might go for that, but also there are some other cool characters here that I want to try out. Um, I want to try out Grace over here. Uh, but yeah, I don't... I can't... Uh, hold on. Let me... In case start demo means to confirm that's what I want, <laughs> I'm just going to choose this guy. Oh, wait. Did I do it right? Oh, here we go. Okay. Start demo. All right, let me go and try out these characters here. I hope that's not like, not, not like the confirmation button because <laughs> I didn't see like any confirm. Like I assume it's pressing A, but it, it didn't say. I just saw like there was a return and... That was, like, pretty much it. Hey, look at this guy. Oh my gosh. Um, hold the basic attack button. When he, uh, when Lycone uh, launches his basic attack to charge and enhance his attack, dealing ice damage, each move of his basic attacks can be charged. So here's the basic attack. Okay. Ooh. So is he all about charge attacks? Oh, we can freeze them. Ooh. Character intro, like Cohen Sue. Hold the special attack button when Light Cone launches a special attack or a special attack to charge its attacks. When quickly launched by pressing the corresponding button. EX special attacks consume less energy. After holding the button to charge, EX special attacks become more powerful. Okay, I mean, I didn't really get all that, but I'm gonna trust in what to do, so. 
Ooh, wow. All I know is that you just have to hold the button down for him. <laughs> That's all I know. Oh, free combat session about to begin. Alright, here we go. Oh, here's the other character. That's the one that we unlocked, right? She has a chainsaw. Oh my gosh. Oh, she does a combo attack. Oh, she should have changed. I should have tried to see his ultimate. I really want to see it. Ooh. Let's go for Nicole next. Hey, what is RB? Oh, to go back to him. Okay. Oh, youch. So it's still got a guy here. Oh, we're to Cole now. I didn't even realize I was playing as her. Let's go for him. There we go. And here's the big boss guy. Nice. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, I'm just holding it down. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, that's so cool. Oh, man, dude, just the switching in this game is so satisfying. Oh, I like her. I might just go for the wolf man. I think I might go for him because I like I've been liking this uh, the other character so far. Let me go see his ultimate. Oh snap! What the heck? Oh man, I think I'm kind of sold. Like especially since I already have the other character, I can have all I need is like that like one more maid character, right? To get a full team of like these of this faction. Oh my gosh. And that attack is so cool too, just... Just those rapid attacks. With that... that chainsaw. Oh, okay, confirm. Yeah, I like them a lot. That's cool. I don't know, I might just dedicate this whole video just to try out these characters. Uh, we'll see. I still don't know how to select one. Unless it's like just pressing A, which... I didn't see. All I saw was start demo. Yeah, see, start demo here. <laughs> That's all. Um, Soldier 11. But yeah, I'm not really interested in like... I mean, yeah, well, I might also... Well, well, yeah, if I get him, then it's automatic that I get her too. So I don't feel like I need to try her out. But I do want to see like this character here and this character because... I like the more, I guess, I guess the more military combat look. Uh, these guys I don't care too much about. Uh, let's go for Grace first. I think she looks cooler. And also more hotter. Alright, let's do it. I think we kind of saw her a bit in the, in the thing. In that agent's menu. But yeah, when did we get to see the other guys? Um... Like the other, like limited, I guess they're limited characters, yeah. Yeah, I saw that she had the SMG. When Grace's basic attack or dash attack hits an enemy and deals physical damage, she gains one stack of zap up to eight stacks. Upon reaching the maximum stacks, using a special attack or EX special attack will consume all stacks of zap, increasing the accumulated electric anomaly build, build up. All right, so oh, basic attack accumulates zap. Oh, I see that zap is below like the icon there, and when it's full, you press. Then she's also cool too with the attacks. Oh wow, okay. So that's pretty much her character. Is that she just? You just all, all you do is just build up. Ooh. 
Oh wait, the other guy is here. I should have played as him. Oh yeah, this guy. I want to see him. Hey, nice. Oh, nice. It's kind of funny with these guys with the guns. Like even I kind of saw this too with the that one with the pistol. Like they kind of just just treat their <laughs> their guns like it's physical weapons. It's kind of funny to see that. So yeah, you, you just keep on spamming it pretty much. Ooh! Wow, look at that. Oh shoot, I kind of messed up the timing. I saw that we can do it again or something. Oh, okay. I'm messing up on that, on that timing. Is that a bomb? So yeah, it's pretty interesting that we can't like choose the character to uh to play as. Yeah, I find that to be very interesting. Let me adjust my mic or my headset. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty interesting that we can't um. Yeah, that we can't do that because you know just only pressing a button to switch to like the next character to play as i feel like that's supposed to be where you know they, they expect us to keep on switching characters which i think is really good i like that like yeah we're not really going to be sticking with one character that much i want to see this character this will be the last one that i do um Wait, all the other ones, uh, we can, you know, wait out for a bit. I think it's fine. I want to see this, the Soldier 11. I think, um, you know, just from, like, the, the looks of her, I think she also looks pretty cool, too. But we'll see how she's, like, in, in battle. Soldier 11, that's her name, right? Is she going to be, like, the generic soldier class? Like, Soldier 76? But she has a sword. Okay. Uh, press the basic attack button at the right moment. Soldier 11 will deal fire, will use fire suppression, dealing fire damage. At the right moment, though. I'm supposed to time my attacks? That's just what it sounds like to me. I just had to time my attacks or something. After using an EX special attack, chain attack, or ultimate basic attacks and... Um, dash attacks are guaranteed to trigger fire suppression. So this is all just to trigger fire. I wonder if there's also like an ele elemental reaction to this game. I'm not sure. Or is it just like, you know, effects that just does, does its thing. I'm guessing it's the, the latter that I said. But so far there hasn't been anything about like what I said. Wait, there's the bear. I saw that we can play as the bear. Hey! Oh my gosh, dude. Oh yeah. <laughs> I want to see the bear. I remember seeing the bear, dude. Like in... The, when I saw the... That special program thing. Oh, that's so funny. Dang, dude. I like how in, you know, with this game, we can also... Just play as, play as like full on animals. Like the characters, man. Okay. Nice. I need to use her ultimate too at some point if, if it's possible. Oh, kind of messed that up. There we go, ultimate. 
But yeah, I think she lo she's okay. I think she does look cool. But I feel like she's, I guess in terms of coolness, she's on the same thing, same like level as Anby. But yeah, I think this will be the last character that I play as. And then we'll just resume the story. Wait, the one I want to go for is the limited characters, though. The, um, which I'm guessing they're limited. The, the one girl with the pistol that can turn, like, her gun to a big gun. That's the one that I want. Hey. Nice. And do these, like, ending cutscenes, man. So the battles are really cool looking, too. And like I said, very good presentation with <laughs> with this whole thing. Oh man. And yeah, that was like three so far. Dang. I mean, if I want, I can just keep on going. Just make this whole video dedicated to this. Okay, you know what? Let's keep on going. <laughs> I'll save you for last. Let's go with this one. Uh, this one, you know, just judging from the design, I don't really care about it. I like that. I do like that that Wolfman though, because then I can make that that one maiden and Butler team. She's a cat. Um, when Nekomata's dodge counter or quick assist hits an enemy, her damage significantly increases for a brief duration. That sounds pretty cool. Wait, we have to, like, do a dodge, though, but I can't even dodge. I can use Y. Wait, how do we do it? Wait, how do we dodge? <laughs> if I can't even use it. Hold on, I need, I need to see this. Dodge counter or quick assist? I'm guessing we gotta press Y for this. Oh yeah, I'm not sure how to really trigger. Like the dodge. Is there a button for that? That I just forgot about? Oh, that's the lock on. Oh. Oh, it's A, okay. I thought we couldn't do it because it's like grayed out. Okay, I got it, I got it. Press A. Oh yeah, I can do the basic attack. <laughs> Okay, do it again. Come on. Oh yeah, I, I got it now. Just gotta press A. Ah, oh, there we go. I got it. That's pretty cool. I feel like this character will be a lot of fun for just if you want to do those counters. Yeah, I forgot we can do the dodge. I haven't been doing that. Because, you know, the characters that I play as, they don't, they don't really have anything to do with dodging, it seems. But this one has a counter. Okay. Wait, how do we flinch? Just do that. Okay, nice. Alright, free combat session. Let's do it. Oh, we can use the ultimate already. Ooh, okay. Ooh, I messed up that dodge. Oh, look at this character. Oh, she got a hammer. Oh, she can just keep on swinging around. Heck yeah. Dude, what the heck is this character, man? Oh my gosh. I freaking love the swings. Nice. Okay. Nice. Try to dodge, but I'm failing. Nice. 
nice. Oh, I should have done the ultimate with the other character. I want to see hers. My bad. <laughs> you do this character, man. Oh my gosh. Oh, screw Anby. Wait, this character is a lot of fun to play as. I really love the, the, the whole dodging thing. <laughs> what is that shot? <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go and confirm now. Alright, we got two more to go. The last one I'll, I'll save the maid. But so far, I think I want to go. I am going to go for the wolf man. I'll just go for her next. I just want to, you know, play through all of them just so I can get the... I still forget what they're called, like the primo gems of this game. But yeah, that's cool. I like how we can do do these demos, and they also teach us how to play as them as well. Because I think, like like with the character trials back in Genshin, they don't really teach us how to play, I think. <laughs> At least I haven't seen it. Maybe I missed it. Um, Coletta, after the second or fourth hit of, of the basic attack, or enhance basic attack, press the, you know, the, the skill button, special attack button, to unleash her special attack. Immediately causing explosion. Oh, okay. So, one, two, then that, uh, like, yeah, that happens. Or one, two, three, four? Wait, one, two, three, four? I can't tell if I'm doing, like, four hits with that. After she unleashes her EX special attack, chain attack, or ultimates, she gains a furnace fire effect. During furnace fire, after the second hit of her basic attack combo, she can expend the fire furnace effect to launch an enhanced basic attack, dealing massive fire damage. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Wait, why is the bear guy here? See, after doing that launching thing. Wait, why is he here again? Yeah, I don't know if I did it or not. I just, <laughs> I just... I just did whatever there. But yeah, with her, we just gotta pretty much... There we go. Wait, why is the bear guy always here? Is there a thing with, with him? That like, he just keeps on appearing for her. It yeah, look like he just keeps on appearing. That's really cool. I don't know what's making that happen, but I mean, I, I do like that in general. You think she'll also appear for the other characters too, or is it just that bear guy? Or is that maybe like a passive for the bear guy? I think that's a really cool passive, that if that's really a thing. Have you seen his ultimate? I forgot if he did. Oh wow. Nice. Okay. There we go. Yeah, the whole counter system is very satisfying. Hey, Bear Man. Oh wait, he just stays there? If you just hold it down? Oh wow. Yeah, I'm trying to hold down the the attacks too sometimes. Just to see if they do anything different. I'm gonna use her ultimate. 
Yeah, so I think it's more of her passive. I don't know. I guess she summons that, that bear guy, which I think is really cool. <laughs> I do like that a lot from her. Anyway, so yeah, that was it for her. Um, now we got one more left, which is the maid girl. All right, let's go and start her. She's the last one. But yeah, I think after I get the wolf guy, I'll go for her. And then there we go. I got my <laughs> my uh, my housekeeping uh, team here with the with the butler and the maids. Oh, what the heck? What's that stance? What is her pets? Rena. When Rena launches a basic attack, special attack, or EX special attack, she sends out Drusilla and Anastella to attack, dealing electric damage. While they're both attacking, Rena's basic attack combo won't be interrupted by her other attacks. Uh, when either uh, Bang Boo is sent to, out to attack, uh, pen ratio is increased for the other squad members. The buff ends when both um, Drusilla and Anastella return to Rena's side. Okay. Um. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> she floats? Okay. What the heck? Dude, that's that's kind of creepy. She's kind of scary. So yeah, she sends them, sends them out. Oh, she's very unique. Oh yeah, she does feel she does feel very unique to me. Oh, this is like our first, I guess, mage-like character that I've seen. Okay. Nice. Oh my gosh, try to use my ultimate, but I had to switch there. Alright, right, let me go use my ultimate on these guys. Oh, okay. Nice. But dude, the whole housekeeping team is going to be very interesting, man. <laughs> Time to step up the attack. Like, yeah, things would be very, very unique with the gameplay. Just having her, then that one saw lady, that saw maid, and then the wolf man to do like the freezing stuff. Alright, go for it. Wait, I think the way she attacks is really cool too, because she just sends out those two bong boos. It feels like a summon. Yeah, I think it's, she's really cool too. I don't. I think the whole that housekeeping team. I think I'm, I'm gonna really enjoy that. <laughs> all right, guys. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it for this video. That was just me just trying out all the the characters here. Yeah, that was very very interesting. So yeah, I assume we just press on them to. I guess assign, or is this like just showing like, like, what's available? If I, if I just press A. No, yeah, it doesn't look like we can choose. I thought maybe we can choose here. But no, we can't. I see that 0 out of 300. Hmm. Okay. Oh, so wait. Is it when we actually get to it? Oh, I see. I think once we reach it, that's when we can select. Oh. And then, yeah, we can do some signal searches right now. Well, hold on. I want to see. Um, I'm guessing this is the limited one, right? So, though, on the top right, I'm guessing those are, 
you know, like the um, like the fates and stuff in this game. There's like a rainbow one, and then there's like the the basic one, and we got 21 of the basic ones. But I think I'll go ahead and open that in the next video. So yeah, that was me just trying out all these selectable agents. I think that was really cool. But yeah, uh, we'll see if we can try to get anyone <laughs> um, in here. But yeah, if I had to select one, the Wolfman goes first, and then that other maid lady, and then after that, well, we can choose like I guess whoever else. Um, I'm thinking either uh, what's her name, like Grace, and that one girl with the explosions. I think she seems really fun too. Anyway, guys, yeah, that'll be it for now. That's game. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day.